Hello traders. Today we are going to dis analyze the account where the client is only trading into XAUSD where his current M2M is 10,000 dollar almost and uh, use some of the methods where he did a uh, complex martingale which is like, supposed to be in that scenario where 0.46 lot in the buy side and 0.3 lot into the sell side so we'll discuss that how we can reduce the losses with the minimum risk and if they if he follows our levels and how he can able to generate a profit in efficient way as you can see that it is the trade max global live accounts and uh, the details of his trade is yes we already started the trade into his account and we already made a profit of 400 euros but still the profit we have to cover the 10,000 so what are the status we are going to trade on his accounts and how we can reduce his losses by making the profit into XAU USD only so the, we will see the all trades open trades and this is empty for account you can see his live trades the live servers and his total balance is fifteen thousand dollars which is you can see in either in android and in a desktop mt4 terminal so we'll take the some of the statistics and how to take that statistics in the live so we have analyzed his total load size as you can see here that the current XAU price is 1937 So the current loss is 9 and 0 it is you can see there is almost same loss showing into this and in here okay. so what here we did that we did average mean price of his trade which is equivalent to from his lot size we have derived it and he has traded a 0.46 lot size in a buy side and sell side he traded 0.3 lot size so the mean price for the sale is 1725 and buy price for average is 2014 the current rate is 1937 so the buy profit buy side loss is 357 both are running into the loss and sell side loss is 6337 so total loss is around ten thousand dollars here what we can see that if is the price if he is going with the same strategy if we are not doing anything so when will we get the break even if we keep the two thousand dollar the price of xusd still the loss is here eight thousand nine hundred if the price is recovered to two two zero zero then still the loss cannot be recovered as we reach to the two six zero zero price then the loss will be recovered as the buy profit we can see here 26,000 and the loss profit so the 699 profit can get it at once the XAUSD price reached to 2600 as we can see from the chart that to get the price of XAUSD to that levels which is quite long time to take us this is the all time high is 2054 above where to get those prices to beat hard as it has to reach to the above and around 2600 price and it takes 
longer period of time as you can see six or seven month or eight month till that he could not able to recover his losses so rather than waiting for 2600 price and in meanwhile if the xusd start to fall between 1800 his loss will increase to 12000 dollar so and we don't want that one so we'll again back to the excel sheet you can see here at what the step we can take to reduce it as suppose xusd goes to the 1800 current price then his loss increase to 12000 dollar and so most probably that is not a good idea to do it so what we suggest if what and we are going to do as per our level strategy with the point one lot we will trade at 1920 as it is our strong resistance level and once it is recovering from 1920 and if it's not recovering then point two we will buy it 1900 point four will buy it 1890 point eight will buy it 1875 and 1.6 will buy it 1850 which is a very strong support and it's not going to happen below that price and if we see it that what will be his current loss as his capital is 15,000 so this one will be the our break even point as his loss reached to the 16,000 but in between that the XUS they keep on recovering that we have to keep it in mind that it won't get that price constantly without recovering to that phase so this loss is the maximum loss but till that we must probably take the fire 3000 to six thousand dollar profit if as what we are going to do in this condition that we are explaining that first one point one load size we will keep booking profit at one nine five zero in between fifteen to thirty points which will be the profit of four hundred dollar to five hundred USD with a point one load size as point one load size the 10 point equal to 100 dollar profit so we will keep doing that and so the point is there to reduce the losses now if suppose taxi usd price recover it to back to the 1900 from 1900 so you can see that is almost recovered his loss around 300 only so the price has recovered to 1920 back to the current rate he could have make a gain of six thousand dollar easily and if you could not able to get this scan so in between we will keep booking the profit and we will keep reducing the loss as we will follow this pattern of the trades strictly with the proper SL and TP as for the level only but this is just a representation that uh, without following the uh, any other SL and TP if you follow this uh, lot size gradually with those these levels and once it is recovered 70 points he can grab he can cover all of his losses and he can book the six thousand dollar profit but what we will do it we will keep the 10 points SL from each level SL of 10 points and we'll book, keep booking the profit of 20 to 30 points so in that way we will we don't we won't do the martingale without SL so we, we will keep doing this lot size and we'll keep in uh, booking the profit of 20 to 30 points over so risk reward always we will maintain 1 gem 2 to 1 gem 4 so maybe sometime it hit SL of the 10 point but it won't happen always and we will keep booking the profit and loss and we will maintain so if it falls we will keep buying from the level we will keep sl the 10 points we will keep booking the profit of 20 to 40 points so we will maintain the risk reward of 1 gem 2 to 1 gem 4 but this is the scenario that if he just follow this pattern without any sl and tp and uh, he can recover his losses once the price is recovered from this point but the best point is that trade with this lot size if it covers 1900 you book the profit at 1920 to 1940 book the profit of 0.2 lot size into 
divide it by 4 so book the profit of 0 0.05 0 0.05 in, in 10 10 points gap so in that way you can book the partially profit and keep revising of your remaining position to the cost price and book keep booking the profit so if we follow the process it can recover the loss and the account will be in the profit less than one month less than a month he can recover all his losses of ten thousand dollar and his account will be in the profit of five thousand dollar after the recording the losses if he follow the simple strategy by trading on our levels and hopefully that is the best scenario that remaining five thousand dollar of his capital because in this position uh, if it breaks the 1800 price then only his loss is going to increase to $12,000 but why should we wait for that level to fall we have the lot of opportunities we are seeing already that gold is uh, trading 1920 to 1930 1940 consistently and if it falls below 1900 we should not worry about that we have the, all the levels and we have the SLs and we have the TP so and we will not touch into the sell parts keep the sell losses running we will keep booking the profit and once the account is in the full profit we will book the loss once by booking the profit so hope this strategy is quite simple it won't require you the big mathematics it's a simple numbers as and it can easily achievable if it follows with uh, by following the our telegram free channel of the forex trade one it can easily analyze it, it can easily be traded that we are keep focusing in our channel about the levels and high strategy as if you are already hedging with the sell GBP USD then this scenario won't happen as we as the thing is that he did not follow any SL in his this and he did a wrong hedging where he keep the buying and he lock his loss and profit at 1800 below it it increased the losses but to recover a point he it has to cross the 2600 gold price current that is the quite hard as currently it is trading 1935 you can see that to reach to the 2600 it might take six months to seven months or it might take the one year also so to wait rather than we should follow the strategy and make account profitable in one month and if suppose in a initially if you follow the sell gbp usd as we are discussing in our channel that you should hedge your position then this scenario won't happen as once the other position in the profit once position in the loss so we will keep the running the profit into the higher side and we will book the loss at shorter side so your risk remain always small and you wait reward in a big follow this strategy you can never make a loss into the forex market hope you enjoy the videos and hope you learn so many things and definitely it will give you the clear concept of the hedging and proper trading and to follow the levels with proper risk and reward